How do you feel that your name is being dragged through the mud as someone that is a co-conspirator to the Biggie killing? Yeah, you know, it, it hurts, but I don't mind about the Biggie killing. So what? I don't care. I hate that being leaked to a murder because that's not me. And so that's how I feel on the Biggie thing. You know, now that I hear Miss Wallace talk and see her, I kind of feel bad. Her son's getting older. She, he, listening to Biggie talk, he seemed like a nice guy and a cool dude and all of that. But what hurts me to this day is when people say about Tupac. I defend that to the T. It, it, it drives me crazy because there's somebody I knew, was dealing with, I was, worked for, had a relationship with his mom after his death, prior to his death. That bothers me. But Biggie, I can care less, man. It makes more sense to link you to Biggie than to Pac because of everything you did for Pac. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but it would it would make more sense. But I think in this podcast they're linking you to both. To both. Yeah. I'm the big bad boogeyman. Yeah, and Sharitha as well. Which don't make sense. Her daughter was out there with you when when this incident went down. She she gonna let her daughter go out there and be possibly be in the car with you, and she gonna be involved in setting up him getting killed or shot. But that's just because it didn't make sense. Everybody kept saying, ah, that don't make sense. Why would Shug be in the car? And so all of them had to change up. Oh, because they were on Shug. They were Reggie and Shug, Reggie and Shug, Blue Half Dead and all of that. But then they had to change, change up when people started questioning that. That don't make sense. Oh, yeah, we apologize to Shug. Even though everybody's still saying Shug, Reggie, and L. Well, that's, that's, we probably, Shug didn't have nothing to do with it. He was, he was collateral damage. They were trying to take over his company and stuff. Which if Sharita wanted to take over his company, the only thing she had to do was file for divorce. She would have 50%. Yeah. <laughs> Man, uh, it's crazy. If you're definitely not connected to the Biggie killing, is it still possible that the LAPD, LAPD rogue officers conspired or do you don't buy that either? Well, it's like why? Only reason I believe, nobody knows who actually did it. I believe the Poochie theory because I know of things that Poochie did after it, as far as pushing up for money and all of that, well, that I was told by, you know, people, Teresa Swan, um, how he would come around and how she pretty much was kind of glad or relieved <laughs> when Poochie was finally turned up dead because he didn't have to worry about him continuing to push up for, him, for money. And so that alone was what makes me believe, okay, that he p possibly did it, but if he didn't do it, he was letting people believe that he did. And one of his friends that was best friends at the time, Little Rod, Little Rat, Boulevard, they call him, from, was, was in prison where I was at, at Atwater, but he was at the Big Pen. He also was like, Reggie, you know, he called me, you know uh, Poochie killed Biggie. This was his boy, this was, they were crimes together. So all of that, I believe Poochie did it. I wouldn't bet my life on it, but it makes more sense than anything. I used to be the biggest advocate that the South Side did it. But Keefe D coming out saying that they didn't. What's crazy about all of this is people always say, Biggie, um, Poochie lied. He just covered up for LAPD. But he copped out to a, a shooting in Vegas. LAPD had nothing to do with that. They wanted to solve the Biggie homicide. So if we're going to get him to lie, what would I have him lie about? Biggie's murder, not Tupac's murder. Thanks for watching StreetTV.net. If you're not subscribed, please hit that button below and click the bell to receive alerts and notifications. Feel free to comment below so you can give us your feedback and be sure to watch the two related episodes to the right. If you want to support this platform or follow us on social media, visit the links in the description. And thanks for watching StreetTV.net.